Okay there, welcome back Google Tube. Alright, today we're going to mess with some cab drivers. Now, I paid this cab driver to take me to my other garage. You'll see, he screwed up, didn't even make the turn, and he charged me for it. His mistake. Well, watch what happens when I get to my garage. There's another one of them dash hound buses. Now, if you see one of those, if a bunch of them dash hound buses are parked in front of that cemetery with the graveyard in it, chances are you're going to get to her solo. But there's another one. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, you'll see he'll he'll miss my turn up here. Then he'll make me a U-turn. Then he charges me for it. Now I kill him. Alright, spoiler alert. I killed him. You know, I gave him a couple hundred bucks to take me out here, right? When I kill him, I only get $17. What the hell is up with that? What happened to my couple hundred dollars I gave him? It's kind of wrong. Not very likely to happen. Unless I paid him my credit card. But it came out of my money uh, account here. Yeah, I just took the cab just to be uh, lazy. Because I'm going out here and... Uh, Stocking up on some more Sand Kings. You know, I could have just um, had me spawn in my other garage, but... Yeah, what the heck. What the heck. But I lost a couple hundred dollars. Even though I robbed him, I didn't get my money. Now, he's supposed to make this right-hand turn here. Watch what this idiot does. He always does this, too. Goes right by it. Right by it. And he gets almost to the tunnel till he realizes he, he screwed up. I should have been able to pop him right in the head, right then and there. Stupid jackass. You know, I get charged for this. I get, I mean, he goes quite a bit out of the ways and then makes the U-turn. You know, what's he trying to do? Make some extra money there. That's not right. That is not right. And when I rob him, I only get $17? Are you freaking kidding me? I have not been able to uh, get cab fares online. On story mode, if I, you know, take a cab, I, I can do it. You can't jack a cab driver like you can in um, story mode and then play cab driver, unfortunately. You know, in ca in, you, know you could just uh, carjack them in uh, story mode, but you can't do it on online. You gotta kill them. It's the only way you're gonna get a cab. And the dispatcher doesn't call over the radio so you can pick up fares. It's kinda stupid. It's, I wish you would run over that guy on that motorcycle. Don't know what's up with that, but whatever. You're going to get a one star when you kill this guy. It's an automatic one star. But it's up by my garage, so I slip into my garage and avoid the one star. You cannot put this car in your main garage. Now, if you damage it a little bit, you can take it to the custom shop. I'll tell you about that one in a few minutes here. Because we're getting to the good part. People who've seen my video, they know which garage I'm at. Is over there by the uh, 
military base. This is the one I keep my mariachi car in. Alright. Now since this was a really, really, really horrible driver, I, I just killed him. Well, I guess seventeen dollars. The hell is up with that? I just gave him a couple hundred bucks. Well, I'm just gonna park it here for safekeeping for now. Like you can take it to the mod shop. You can sell it. You're not gonna be able to sell it for that much. It's really not even worth doing. But I don't know if you gotta wait uh, their, their 24 hour period to keep on uh, stealing them and selling them because I sold a vehicle before I uh, called the cab and it hasn't been a 24 hour period in the GTA so maybe you can just keep on um, doing this you only get 1300 bucks for it but you're in a lobby with somebody it's only being a jackass to you okay you pick them up in a cab be real nice to them so yeah I just stole the yada 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 first thing I'm gonna do is mod it up at the mod shop wink wink gonna do go to the mod shop and put some uh, remote explosives on he goes down the street you set him off <laughs> that's what I did to somebody you know so that's what I did but I kind of mucked this car up a little bit so I can get it into the mod shop. Yeah, if it's undamaged, you're not going to be able to get it in there. And like I said, you're not going to be able to put it in your personal garages either. And it's kind of fun to play with. A little bit. I did a um, showcase on one of these, oh, probably about two months ago. It's down in my video file there on the uh, channel there where I showcase this one in a cop car and a few other ones. So it's it's down in my video files if you want to see it there. If you like these videos, give them a like. It, it lets me know if uh, you like the videos here. Better than new. Okay, you'll see what I'm doing here. Okay, but that's pretty much the end of this, so... Hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching, and I shall see you in the next video here.